my name is Jeremy. We're going to be going through a short uh, but fairly thorough warm up to get you into an arabesque shape, uh, what we call in yoga airplane pose. Um, so we're going to work towards that. Uh, so to start, we're going to be in a seated position on your shins. So shins flat on the ground, the tops of your feet flat on the ground as well. Bring your hands wherever is comfortable. Close your eyes. Take a second to settle in, and if this feels intense on your knees or on your quads, take a blanket, a towel, something to sit underneath your sit bones to lift them up. That should take the pressure off of your legs. And in yoga, more important than anything is the breath and the connection and the focus that you have with that breath. So we'll start together. Take a breath in through your nose. Hold it at the top, just a gentle hover, and then open your mouth and exhale. We'll do that twice. Inhale, breathe through your nose. Hold at the top. Open mouth, side out. One more time in. Hold. Open mouth, release. Good. Next breath in, seal your lips. Hold. Then exhale through your nose this time. And then twice, just like before. Inhale through your nose. Hold, exhale through your nose, and one more in, pause, and out. All right, let's start to add some movement. On an inhale, reach both of your hands up, and then exhale, let your left hand fall out to the left side of your mat. We'll take a side body stretch. So press your left hand flat, straighten your left arm as much as you can, reach your right arm up and over. Two rounds of breath. Inhale back to center, and then exhale over towards the right. Press your hand down so you get long. And each of these isn't necessarily about the stretch. It's not about how flexible you are to get into the pose, but how you can power into the pose. And then inhale back to center, and we'll take that breath to move and exhale to the left. Inhale to center, and exhale to the right. And keep both hip bones down. One more time each side. Left. Inhale center. Exhale to the right. All right, we're going to add on. Inhale to center. Exhale to the left, take it a little wider, shift over and lift your hips up, straighten out your right leg. Now you're in a side plank variation. Now press everything that's touching the ground down to get lifted. Exhale back down, other side, reach up, side plank towards the right, straighten out your left leg, breathe in, exhale, press everything down, open up, back through to center, inhale, one more time, exhale towards the left, breathe in. Exhale back down, inhale, reach up, exhale towards the right, full breath in, full breath out, inhale back to center, and down to the ground, full round of breath, let it settle. All right, we're going to add on to that again. We're going to take it into more of a sugar cane pose, dancer variation. So inhale, reach up, exhale over towards the left, straighten out your right, right leg, and then lift your right leg up. Now hold here, this can be enough. You can bend your leg a little bit if you're feeling a lot in your hip flexor. If you want to take this further, kick your heel towards your glute and then grab it. Kick your foot into your hand. And again, everything that's touching the ground, press it down so you're engaged and lifted. And then take two rounds of breath. Fill up your belly. Empty your belly. One more time in. And out. And gently release. Stretch it back out straight. Enter the way that you came in. Slow and methodical. Give your arms a shake. Other side, inhale over towards the right. Straighten out your left leg. If you want to stay here, stay. Otherwise, lift it off the ground. You can stay here or kick your heel to glute. Grab it with your hand. Kick your foot into your hand. Open up your chest. Press everything that's on the ground down. Two breaths. And release gently on an inhale. Everything back up. Right where you came in. Exhale both hands down to the ground. All right. Reach up through center. Exhale, fold. Walk your hands forward on a breath in. Lengthen up, lift your elbows. Exhale, lower it down. One more in. And out. All right. Next, we'll meet in a tabletop pose. So tabletop is hands underneath your shoulders, knees underneath your hips. Spread your fingers wide, like you get a long, wide base. And then from here, three rounds of cat-cat. So it's inhale, pull your belly forward. 
hold here. Then can you draw your belly button up and in, point your tailbone up, drag your chest forward like you're trying to get your belly to touch the ground, but your chest stays lifted high. And then exhale, cow pose. Okay, or rather cat pose, tuck your tailbone to your face. Look at your belly button, and if somebody lit a, as if somebody lit a fire underneath your belly, press the ground more so your spine lifts up higher, your chest gets a little higher as well. And then two rounds of breath to movement. Inhale to cow, pull up forward. Exhale, press and round to cat. Again, inhale, pull forward. Exhale, press and round. Back to tabletop. All right, got your spine warmed up. We're going to add some movement there. Tuck your toes, lift your knees an inch off the ground for beast pose. And notice when you lift your knees, the belly wants to lower, your tailbone wants to lift. Level them out, middle and lower back in line with one another. You're gonna start here on a breath in, then on your exhale, hop forward, feet come towards your wrist, and then you're into a chair pose. So this low squat, hands above your head, turn your thumbs out and your pinkies in, taking a breath. Exhale, hands down, hop it back to that beast pose. Same thing, knees hover over the ground. Take an inhale. Exhale, hop forward. Inhale, chair. Exhale, back down to beast. <sighs> inhale. Exhale, hop forward. Start that into a flow. Reach up. Inhale. Exhale, down. <sighs> inhale. Exhale, make it a little faster. <sighs> inhale. Exhale. <sighs> Two more times. Inhale. Exhale. <sighs> Once more in. And then out. <sighs> beast pose. Full round of breath. And you're back in a mountain pose, we're going to add on to that flow. So from here, it's going to be into a, a mountain pose with a back bend. So for your back bend, squeeze your thighs together so they stay stationary. Reach your thumbs up and back. So as if somebody took their hand and placed it in the middle of your back to lift, but your hips stay stacked. Breathe in. Then on your exhale, chair with airplane arms. So reach your arms behind you, reach your chest forward. Inhale, back up, straighten, and then get a back bend, mountain pose. Exhale, chair with airplane arms. We'll do that twice more in. Reach up and back bend. Exhale, chair with airplane. One more in. And out. And then inhale, reach up to mountain pose. Hands to your heart. All right, next one, we're going to start at the back of your mat. And this time, we're going to take it into that full airplane, plo air airplane pose. All right, we're going to meet at the back of your mat, and this time we're going to take it into that full airplane pose. So we'll start with your left leg lifted into a one-legged mountain pose. All right, so now we're going to step into a crescent lunge. So as far forward as you can step your left foot into your crescent lunge, but the stack is important. Left knee on top, back heel on top of your toes. On an inhale, reach up, then exhale into airplane or arabesque. Reach forward, reach your right leg off the ground, and your hands behind you stretch out. Now you can take this further by reaching your hands forward, or if it feels better in your shoulders, keep it back. Inhale, back up to high crescent. Inhale, reach up. That's right, I didn't do that. All right, so we're going to start at the back of your mat. This one we're going to take into a one-legged mountain pose. So hands above your head. Left knee lifts up in towards your chest, but bring it in line with your left hip. Breathe in. Then on your exhale, crescent lunge. So step your left foot forward. Come into your crescent lunge. So your knees are stacked. Your back heel is stacked. On an exhale, airplane pose. Reach forward. Float your right leg. Good. And then we're going to take that back. Inhale to high crescent. Exhale, airplane. Shift forward. Again, inhale. Exhale, lift. Again, inhale. Exhale, lift this time, hold. Now the only difference here is that you turn your right toes and right hip point down to the ground rather than attempting to stack them. We're gonna take three, uh, we're gonna take three squats. So for this one, the only difference is your right hip and right toes turn down so your hips are level with one another. And we're gonna take it into three squats. Inhale, bend your left leg, lower your chest straight down. Exhale, press and lift. Twice more, inhale, lower. Exhale, press and lift. Again, inhale, low. Exhale, press and lift. All right, for this flow, we're gonna take it.
Okay, so we're going to start at the top of your mat. Inhale, lift your left leg up, one leg in mountain pose. On your exhale, crescent lunge with an airplane arms. So step your left foot back, land with your hands extended behind you. From here, we're going to take it into airplane pose. Shift forward, float your left leg. And inhale, high crescent. Exhale, airplane. Take that twice more. Inhale, high crescent. Exhale, airplane. Once more, inhale, crescent. Exhale, airplane. This time, hold here. So your arabesque shape, except your left toes point down and your left hip levels in line with your right. And then it's three rounds. Inhale, bend your right leg so you lower down like a squat. Exhale, press and straighten up. Control your body up here. Inhale, lower again. Exhale, press and straighten. One more time. Inhale, low. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, one leg at mountain pose. Left knee comes up with you. Exhale, hands to heart. Samasta Hiti. Shake out your left leg. We're going to do that on the right side as well. All right. One leg at mountain pose. Right knee comes up with you. On your exhale, airplane pose. Right leg back. Float your torso out. Again, inhale back to one leg at mountain. Exhale, airplane pose. Inhale, one leg at mountain. Exhale, airplane pose. This time, hold. Inhale, bend your left leg. Lower down straight and flat. Exhale, press up. Twice more through. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, press up straight. One more in. And out. And then inhale, one leg at mountain. Exhale, hands to your heart. Samasthiti. 